Hey there everyone, this is Chris from the Tech Basement, once again down in the basement. Today we are going to show you how to redo your VR room setup. Now with that being said, uh, we have moved some furniture around that has given me more space to move around. So we're going to optimize that space with what we were given. So first of all, what we need to do is make sure you're headset is connected as well as your uh, satellites there the headset is connected just it's not alive yet and then once we get going we will start up the wands whatever you want to call them so we just come up here go to room setup and we just set, uh, start the process basically as you can see the headset has turned on and we get this wonderful animated uh, walkthrough. So we're not going to do a standing only. We're doing room scale. So let's click on that. Uh, now it's asking us to move everything out of the way, which I'm actually going to have to do. And so this is where we're going to transition over into the... the uh, uh, room that you see up here so just give me a moment to do that okay we have everything moved out of the way for right now and these over here I might move out when I do uh, my VR and that's just to save my toes and my legs things like that from bumping into it because I'm gonna want to give about the uh, foot and a half to two feet that are right here uh, where I want the the guide or the bar or whatever you want to call that the boundary is what it's called I'll put that about right there and give me a little bit of room over here though on this side I want to optimize the room I have uh, so I'm gonna put this fairly close to that I'm gonna keep it away from this TV right here because uh, I'm going to get a little closer with that because what I'm going to do is uh, probably build a shield that I'll hang up and over that when I go to uh, play my VR game. So uh, give me a minute to get this started. We're going to come over here and press that. Turn on controllers and place the controllers and headset in a close... Uh, location visible from the base stations no problem let's move this a little bit maybe even like that yeah let's start a fire with those that'd be good uh, let's see turn these on and actually I'm gaining quite a few feet in space so that's gonna be nice Okay, headset controllers ready. Next, pull trigger and hold. Locate the monitor. Stand in the middle of your cleared space. I think that can be done. Right here. All right. Now, yeah, I'm going to have to run back over there. Okay. Okay. Calibrate floor. Okay, let's see. Place both controllers on the floor and invisible to the base stations and click calibrate floor button and wait while calibration completes. You can also click the trigger and then place the controller on the floor to finish calibration. Seeing that we're at the Place both controllers. Okay, did that. 
Okay, now it's going to have me do the boundaries that we're going to want to live by with this. So, we'll identify your available space. Yes, okay. You may impede your movement while wearing the headset. Okay. Click next. And this is how we're going to uh, define our boundaries. So, we're going to start right about here. And I can feel go da, 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 da. And we're gonna come over here. And like I said, I'm gonna get really close to this. I'm gonna kind of come out like that over here. And then over here once again. Okay. That is what we have. Okay. Hold the trigger and trace it. Yep, did that. Okay, so we gained quite a bit. Now that is not bad at all. So we will definitely accept that. Yay, now I'm done with it. There you go, everyone. Now that is the way you reconfigure your room, either if you're making it larger or smaller. So it's as easy as that. Do you have any questions? Put them down below. Any comments also, put those down below too. And, you know, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell so you can get more of these uh, videos. This is Chris saying out.